What's going on, y'all? Welcome to day 37. Let's go, man. Let's go. Hey, y'all. Uh, yesterday, we just got out of our full body introduction into our muscle building, muscle mass increasing type of exercise, y'all. Full body. We definitely took our body through some things, but by this point of the program, day 37, your body should be feeling amazing. It should be feeling aligned and really ready to find a new range of motion today, y'all. And as in every single stretch that we have been doing throughout this program, we have been improving our flexibility, stability, mobility, and balance, y'all. Four big key things whenever you're trying to incorporate stretching into your routine. All right? Hey, y'all, if y'all haven't done so already, hit that subscribe button so you can stay updated with our channel. And also, head over to our website, y'all. Go and look at your Spark product as it can be a great benefit to your health and wellness path. We got a lot of things that's on sale that you want to make sure that you have in your home to keep up with your Spark mentality. So go check it out. Also, go check out our mission and vision, y'all. We're trying to build what's called a Spark community and your contributions will definitely be a big help in that effort, y'all. So, hey, y'all, without further ado, we're gonna get into it. Um, before we do any type of exercise, including stretching, we have to make sure that our bodies are properly warmed up. So, although our body is feeling great by this time of the program, we still need to make sure we warm up, all right? So make sure you get that water and we're going. Get that spark water. I got my spark bottle. Do you got yours? If not, go to that website and get it after your session today, all right? <laughs> Here we go, here we go. Three, two, one, let's go. Just gonna take our time. Jog it up. Straight jacks. Nothing too hard. Just getting our full body warmed up so we can find a new range of motion today. Three, two, one, jump rope. Down. 
go into some downward dogs. touches. Slight bend at those knees. Come back up. Three, two, one. Get to that jump. Come on. Two, one, straight jacks. to a downward dog.
three, two, one, push up shot. One, high knees. Shoulder touch. Three, two, one, push ups. Into it, let's get into it. All right, let's 
Make sure that we are taking it easy and get that spark water because, you know, you should feel proud of where you are. You should have a light sweat on you right now. Not nothing too hard. We want to make sure that we're taking it lightly on our stretching days, especially in our warm up, to set us up for success with a new range of motion, y'all. So you're still pushing yourself slightly, but not as hard as previous days, y'all. So, hey man, congratulations for making it to day 37, y'all. It's so tough to keep going, I know it. And you are that much stronger when you keep going. Hey, y'all, we could have bring, bring our God in. Um, he had us before and during that warm up, and now he's gonna have us right now and after and beyond after your session today. So bring our God in and give thanks to the most high. Here we go. Dear God, thank you so much for um, getting us through that warm up and workout and allowing us to just stay consistent, to keep our body moving mentally and or physically. Uh, help us to continue to stay emotionally um, there in our um, exercise routine as it pertains to our health and wellness. And just allow us to take those progressive steps um, as we continue getting younger through exercise. Uh, please continue to guide us in this workout. Please help those to help those that have not found you or to try to build a relationship with you to start uh, today or sometime soon. Uh, guide them and guide us as a family and to make sure that we are continuously moving in your steps that you ordered for us. Um, God, please protect us in this workout uh, to reduce any anything that can act as a barrier to our consistency. Uh, allow us to find a new range of motion today and really to focus on our flexibility, stability, mobility, and balance improvements. And to just see that all improvements does not mean that the scale has to move. However, improvement is based on what we are accustomed to doing and what we are uh, becoming. Um, that is improvement in, in the new um, efforts that we are able to provide in addition to our um, uh, normal efforts. Um, that is progress, that is consistency, and that is improvement. Uh, please allow the viewer to understand what their improvement is that they don't know, and to allow myself as well as my family and friends and loved ones to recognize what they can do too, because we all know that doing a little something is better than a whole lot of nothing. Jesus, protect us in this workout. God, protect us in this workout. In your name we pray, in Jesus' name, amen. Hey, y'all, we're fit to get into the stretch. Let's do it. It's nothing real light and control before we get into our um, new range of motion flexibility um, exercise. Let's do it. Alright, so get into your spot. Go into an inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. One more inhale, exhale, arm across the chest, grab it, hug yourself, arm 90 degrees, push it back towards you. Okay, I'm gonna bring it down, other side up. Hug yourself, arm 90 degrees, push it back towards you. Bring it down, tricep, and serratus anterior stretch here. Relax that head inside of this slot right here. Let your head relax. Bring it down, other side. Bring it down, inhale, get into a T position, go into that hamstring stretch, reach up to the ceiling and look at that palm.
Bridge it down. Inhale. Exhale. Other side. Other side. Look at that palm. Inhale, exhale, squeeze together, inhale, exhale, kick one leg out, sit back on that heel, grab your toe, bring it back, inhale, exhale, Back, inhale, exhale, two more, inhale, exhale, one more, inhale, and exhale. All right, y'all, we're gonna get into it. Um, remember to take your time um, and find your new range of motions. Um, your new range of motion is getting a little uncomfortable, right? So in your stretches, um, if you're doing any stretch and you know that's your normal range of motion, try to go a little past that, okay? Where you kind of feel a little something, but the pain is not too sharp. You don't want a sharp pain. You want something that's probably about to just become sharp, if that makes sense. So you want to have a slight discomfort in your stretching to find a new range of motion because we're going to be holding it for a, in a lot of amount of time so that our body can become accustomed to it because remember our body is always trying to adapt and doing the stretches that we're going to be doing today it's going to be a few different movements but a lot more of what we have already learned throughout this program starting from day one all the way to now day 37 so your body should be accustomed to a lot of the normal um, movement patterns that we're gonna be doing today in our stretching, but we're gonna be introducing some slightly new ones now because we're preparing for next week to finish out our program uh, for the 60 day transformation, y'all, because it's gonna get um, a little more intense than what you've been experiencing throughout the program. So let's go, do your thing, take your time, um, and just really try to find your new range of motions in each stretch that we do. It's very important that you try to push yourself and breathe through each um, stretch that we do, that we do, okay? So here we go. Get that water and we're going into the first stretch. All right, y'all. Get to your spot. We're gonna go into an inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Arm across your chest. Remember, we're finding a new range of motion. Go slightly past normal. Hug yourself. Arm 90 degrees. Push it back towards yourself. Try to find it. Oh, there it goes for me. I found mine. Did you find yours? I hope you found yours. And just hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Keep your core muscles, your stomach muscles tight. Bring it down. Other side. Push it back. Now hug yourself. Go past normal range of motion. Go. It's a little more intense today because we're not just stretching our normal range of motion first this time. Remember, it's gonna get a little more intense, so we need to tell our body, hey, get ready for more intense exercise. And the way that we're stretching today, which is going right into the new range of motion that we want, is telling our body to prepare for a higher level of intensity that's coming in the future, all right? Now, 
above your head now. Push it down slightly past discomfort. Oh, right there for me. Right there for me. right away and hold it hold it Take your hand and push down. This exercise here is going to prepare us for, make sure you grab your thumb too. Don't just leave your thumb, don't let your thumb be free. Grab that part of your hand too and just go, just like this. And what this is doing is, it's allowing our body to prepare for those bicep curls, more intense bicep curls and tricep curls that we did this week, okay? Make sure your arm is about shoulder level, okay? See how my arm is shoulder level? See how that arm is shoulder level? It's not too far down, it's not too far up, it's shoulder level. And you're stretching those biceps, um, those biceps and um, front shoulders out right here. And your forearms, which is great for a bicep curl. And try not to stand like this. You don't want to stand like this. Get your body straight and shoulders stay level. Keep your stomach muscles tight. That encourages you to stand straight. In three, two, one. Let it release slowly and shake it out, shake it out, shake it out. Let the blood come back to your arms. Okay, other side. Palm facing up, come shoulder level, grab that hand, including the thumb, and push it back towards you. Push it back towards you. Look at the side, okay? You got it. Just hold it, just hold it. Feet shoulder width apart, slight bend at the knees for balance and to keep that back straight. Three, two, one, bring it down slowly, shake it out, shake it out. All right, we're gonna go into some um, hamstrings, quads, inhale, exhale, go down, keep that head aligned with your back, okay? It's okay if you have to come up here. The important thing is that you keep your head aligned with your spine, okay? Try not to slam your head down to your leg. Lead with your chest to keep your head in line with your back, okay? If you lead with your chest and not your head, you will be fine. Find that new range of motion. Here we go in three, two, one. Find that new range of motion. Go, push down, push down. Lead with your chest. And 
inhale, exhale, other side. Normal stretching right here, just like the other side, because we just been standing when we was doing those arm exercises. We wanna make sure we uh, get our legs warmed up and ready to um, find a new range of motion in its flexibility by doing normal stretching first because it's been, it, it was static for a long period of time, okay? If we had a went to our um, lower body first, then we would have went right to normal range of motion. I mean, your new range of motion flexibility stretches right away. All right, now bring it down to the new range of motion. Here we go, three, two, one, find it, find it. Lead with the chest, not your head, lead with the chest. stretching right here. All right, in the next 10 seconds, we're gonna find a new range of motion in our hips. Push the hips down to the floor. Three, two, one. Push the hips down, push the hips down. Slightly discomfort. There we go. Find it. Keep your stomach muscles tight. side of the leg, okay? Take the other palm, we're gonna go up, okay? Check it up. Look at that palm, palm on the floor. Back leg is straight, look at that palm. All right, bring it down, and we're just gonna hold it here, just hold it here. Split that leg, come up, good. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna come up into a lunge position, okay? You're gonna hold it, go down into that lunge, and hold it, hold it. Hands go up, back is straight, back leg is back, is straight. Hands can come down if you have to. Three, two, one, stand it up. Inhale, exhale, right away. Left leg down, whatever leg was back there, that's gonna be down. The leg that you were stretching is coming up, okay? Bring that hand up, bring that leg up. All right, poke that foot out. Hold it, hold it. It's a little challenging because it's new to our bodies. Our bodies have to become accustomed to it. 
you're doing great. Once your body adapts, look what happens. Hold it, hold it. Three, two, one. All right, other side. Get out. Okay. <clears throat> Inhale, exhale, we're going to take it down, back leg is back and straight, alright, palm is on the ground, one hand is on the knee, let me turn towards you so you can see. Left leg is straight, one hand on the knee, one leg is back, palm is on the ground, and we're going. All right, we're gonna find that new range of motion right here. Push that hip down to the ground, keep your stomach muscles tight. In three, two, one, and go. Push some hips down to the ground, hands stay on the knee, back leg is straight, back leg is straight, Got it. You might be shaking, that's okay. As long as it's not too sharp of a pain, okay? This is all finding a new range of motion in your hips now. All right, the hand that's on the knee, Take it up to the back of the room. Look at that palm. Keep that back leg straight. Push the hips to the floor. Look at that palm. Palm is on the floor as well. Everything is in line. You might be shaking. That's okay. It's new to your body. Bring it down. Both hands is inside the leg. The other palm is gonna come up, just like this, just like that. Take your time, take your time. Back leg, stay straight. Look at your palm. You got it, you got it. Shoulder against the knee, knee against the shoulder. And we are here, we are here. Three. Two, one, bring it down, go into a split, bring legs up, inhale, and take it into a lunge position, hands go up, keep them arms straight up, lunge in the middle, hold that balance, stomach muscles tight, you are here, you can come down here if you have to but you're pushing your hips down to the floor, okay? Hands go up, come on. Three, two, one, stand it up. Come straight, inhale, exhale. Bring that leg up, just like this. Poke that leg out, here we go. We are here, you got it. All you, new balance, new flexibility, new stability, and new mobility. Good job. Your body was ready for this. That leg up there. The higher your leg can go, the more balance your body has to adapt to. Five, four, three, two, and one. Break it down. Inhale. Exhale. Two more. Inhale. 
Exhale. One more. Inhale. And exhale. Hey y'all. Uh, great job. Great job. Getting your stretch in today. We stretched some large muscle groups today. Um, and we made sure that we activated some muscles that we normally probably would not have activated before. So let's make sure that in everything we do, especially our stretching, y'all, we take the stretching serious and we know that it's gonna improve our performance and our exercises going forward, y'all. All right? Hey, if there's nothing else, y'all keep going. Let nothing um, discourage you and let nothing get in your way of your consistency, okay? If there's nothing else, SPARK stands for smiles, pride, patience, attitude, accountability, respect, and knowledge, y'all. That is your mentality and lifestyle solution to live your best life. All right? See y'all tomorrow for day number 38. Love y'all. Peace.